Yes, I'm extremely excited. I mean, we've, we've waited a long time for this. Uh, you know, from conception to design and building, it's taken about 20 years. So, you know, we finally got to the stage where these collisions are taking place. Well, just to explain a little bit more about exactly what's been done in the collider and, and what it tells us. OK, what we're doing is we're taking uh, lead atoms and stripping off all the electrons, so there's just the heavy nucleus, and we're colliding them to practically the speed of light, uh, accelerating the speed of light, and then colliding them together in these giant uh, detectors. So my detector, the Alice detector that's been designed this, I mean, it's, it's a 10,000-ton detector, so it's a pretty big detector. And what happens in these collisions is we create these sort of tiny subatomic fireballs, so they're very small, um, but incredible temperatures and densities, as I said, some 10 million million degrees centigrade and almost neutron star density. So it creates a little bit of what the universe was like just a millionth of a second after the Big Bang. Um, how many more of these are you going to try and create or recreate? All the time. I mean, these, these collisions are happening all the time, um, even as we speak. So, you know, we need to collect uh, tens of millions of these collisions um, to really analyse the data and understand what's going on. And how long will it take to analyse it all and, and come up with some answers? Well, I, I mean, like all research, I mean, there's a programme at CERN that will probably last 10 to 15 years. So there's some results that will come out very quickly within weeks. Others will take months and uh, some results will take years. Uh, so uh, as an experiment, I mean, it's a huge undertaking involving dozens and dozens of scientists and an awful lot of money, actually. But do you think it's, it's proving to be worth it? Yeah, I mean, there's, there's about a 1,000 scientists from all over the world, 33 different countries working on this experiment. So it's sort of really a, a global experiment to find out um, about one of the fundamental forces of nature, uh, which is extremely important, and how the early universe evolved. So what we're working on is something called the strong force, uh, which is the force that not only holds nuclei of atoms together, um, but accounts for 98% of the mass of atoms. So 98% of my mass and your mass uh, comes from the strong force, and we don't understand that very well.